what's up beautiful people happy to another vlogtober vlog i'm shanika if you guys are new here thank you so much for stopping by if you're returning i really appreciate you thank you girl um if you're not already subscribed please go ahead and subscribe to my channel i really 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 would appreciate it okay you guys so again like i said welcome back to another vlogtober vlog um because this is a daily vlog i was like i need to take y'all with me to work like i was just going to vlog the morning and i wasn't gonna take y'all with me to work because i know that today is probably going to be slow it's the evening and it's, i mean this is real life and i really want y'all to see the vibe so i don't i'm not leaving out the house until around like 1 50 ish um i don't even think it's 12 o'clock yet uh, i need to go downstairs and make sure that i have clean uniforms because <laughs> I mean, we need clean uniforms to go to work. Uh, I wanted to kind of like make me something to eat too, to like sleep in a little bit and kind of like relax on the days where I have to be to work like later at night. I get to kind of like have a slow morning. So I pretty much spend my slow mornings on my laptop. <laughs> so that's what we did. I just had grapes for breakfast. I didn't even eat breakfast yet. So I think I'm going to just figure that situation out, what I'm going to eat. Go make sure I have clean uniforms and things like that. And I think I'll probably come back on here when we're getting ready to actually go to work. Or maybe I'll pick up the vlog camera sooner. But if I'm going to have y'all with me all day, I need to pop my camera on a charger real quick. So, but yeah, y'all, let me just tell y'all what y'all well, can expect from today anyway, like at work. So, Today, if it's not busy, I'm probably just going to spend time um, helping to like restock the um, cabinet, probably filling up the wax bins, things like that, like just little things around the center. If it's not busy, if it's busy, then we're going to be trying to get this money. Um, I believe that we have a, I believe we have a promo going on this month. Let me go see. We might have a promo going on. Let me see. Okay, y'all, so we officially made it to work. I'm in the car. I have to be here at 2. Um, I check in on my phone, y'all, so I'm about to walk in. So I'm about to just check in real quick. And, yeah, so I can see every like everything off of my phone, my book, what I'm, what, what's going on, who's going to be on my book today. And... Like I said before, it doesn't look like I'm going to be too busy today, which I already kind of figured. So right now, as of now, I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 people on my book as of now. And I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. I have 5 available spaces. Um, out of the 14 people, two of those people are not confirmed. So we'll see like if they show up or not. Um, but on a typical day, my book is normally um, split up into like 15 minute increments. So on a typical day, if I'm just doing like Brazilian and underarms, I can have up to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, uh, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. So on a typical day like today where I'm kind of working like a half shift, I can have up to 25 people. And I only have, and that's if I'm doing like, uh, 15, and doing it in 15 minute increments, which I prefer to wax in 15 minute increments because like I told y'all before, if you watch some of my previous vlogs, my average tip is between ten and twenty dollars every fifteen minutes. Average, if I'm waxing every on average every fifteen minutes, so you do the math. If I have ten to fifteen dollars every fifteen minutes, and I have twenty five people, that's the amount I can be making out with. That's just with tip. That's not including any hourly, any commission from services, and any products that I sell. So the reason why I said my book is kind of slow today is because. I only have 14 people and um, a couple of these people are taking up more than one slot because they're getting longer services like one girl she's getting a full arm a Brazilian and a stomach strip so that turns that goes from instead of being a 15 minute mark uh, block off that's going to be a 45 minute block off 
and then another one of my clients she's getting a Brazilian and a full leg so instead of it being like a 15 minute um, block it's going to be 45 minutes because she's getting a, a it's going to be 15 minutes for the Brazilian then 30 minutes for the full leg so when people book like longer services it's kind of like I kind of be like damn because like I prefer y'all I just prefer to have I would prefer to have 25 people every 15 minutes than to have this be, and then to have people who get longer services and take up more blocks because I'm not getting that like potentially I have the potential to make you know over $40 in an hour if I'm being booked every 15 minutes so when people block off like almost an hour and they give me a $25 tip you know what I mean? Like, it's yes, that's a good tip for, from one person, but I could have got tipped bigger if I had more people in my book. So that's how I look at it, y'all. So the more people for me, the more people, the the more money you get. Um, so yeah, like I said, we are about to walk in. The first thing I do when I go in is uh, prep my room for waxing. So I'm just gonna show y'all how we do that. So I'm on my lunch break and it's been a pretty slow day today honestly it hasn't been it hasn't been that busy at all like I think I waxed maybe seven people since I've been at work and then um, y'all did see me take like the trash out and kind of um, like work and work like clean up in between my clients and then I needed to like put away some inventory so that's what I did this is like crack it's so good job I don't know if y'all know about snap but I'm eating a snap for this is pretty much gonna be my dinner because it's already six o'clock y'all it's late so I'm not gonna eat no more for for the rest of the night um that's only five dollars and it's so good y'all if y'all have a snack where y'all from 
definitely check them out and check out their breadsticks so good and also i just had a full arm brazilian and stomach strip and that was like right after my lunch so this is this will be my second time today taking out the trash because right after her i have a full leg and i can't do a full leg with this trash can looking like this because it won't fit all of the stuff in the trash can so <laughs> And I had a full, the full arm Brazilian and stomach strip that I had was scheduled from 6.30 to 6.15. I got all of that done in 30 minutes. So I'm done her. I was done her at 7 o'clock. It's 7.07. .07, but um, I didn't get on camera. But I've been done. And now, so I got done 15 minutes early. So now I have, so it was originally scheduled from 6.30 to 7.15 and then 7.15, right at the 7.15 with the full lead because she's already here. But since I got that extra 15 minutes because I finished the one client early, I get to take my trash out, clean up so that when my full lead comes in, my room is nice and clean and I don't have to rush. So. Also, um, in between this client, I'm gonna fill my wig spot all the way up because since I just did the girl, she took a lot of wigs. My full leg, anytime I do a full leg before I start waxing, I make sure that I have a full pot of wax. So I fill my pot all the way up to the top. back home i'm showered i just did my little skincare regimen uh i wanted to take a shower before i came on here and i do have on the top y'all i just want to show y'all so y'all not she be on like she on the camera naked <laughs> um so today i'm gonna just break down what we made today like i projected it was going to be a pretty slow day i only waxed 11 people now y'all remember in the beginning of the video i told y'all i had 14 guests three of those people did not show up so it reduced the amount of people that i've seen and um yes yeah, so i was able to take all of my calculations we have an app and so i was able to see how much i made on credit card tips i waxed 11 people i made a hundred and seven dollars on that will be on on off the credit card people tip on a credit card and then i have eleven dollars in cash here so all together we made 118 dollars today just in tips which is really really honestly y'all like on a night like today if i was booked how i wanted to be booked like i said like every 15 minutes i could have made close to 200 dollars um or or even over um on a really busy day so i made out like okay tonight is like i said it was really slow um also i got i made i made 97 i sold 93 dollars worth of products so i made commission off of that i also get commission off of each service that i did so um all together though i wish i had like the, the everything on here but i don't remember exactly how many services i have actually i have the paper okay. So, I did 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, no, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, so I did 18 services today, so 11 people 18 different services i got commission off of each service that i did plus my hourly so although i didn't make out well 
to me, and I'm not gonna say well, I made out okay. Um, in the tip department, I was still able to make money other ways. So again, if you work for a company like this, you are you are not only making money one way. So don't think about just tips. You should be trying to make money in a bunch of different ways. Like you should be trying to add on services to your clients. You should be trying to um, add on products so that you can get that commission. And you should be trying to, you know, do your best so you can get tips. Um, but typically on a day like today, I would like to, if it's slow, I normally pull my laptop out. So y'all know I'm doing Vlogtober. Y'all know I have my YouTube channel. I like to do things on my YouTube channel. So whenever it's slow, y'all, I be multitasking. So it just works out for me well this way because although this is not the end all be all for me, like I don't see myself here forever it works so people are like why do you why are you here why don't you open up your own thing but i'm like i have it allows me the flexibility that i need to be able to invest my time into other things and you can still make really great money like i told y'all if i was booked full today i would have made well like really close to 200 dollars in tips alone but my day was like honestly cut in half i didn't even make like half of the amount of money that i could have been making if i if i was fully booked so um, I'm not worried about it, y'all. Like I said, this is a great job for someone who wants flexibility. If you don't want to, if you want to make good money, but you don't want to have to necessarily work five days a week. If you do work five days a week, though, I'm telling you, like, it's, you can make so much money if you work full time five days a week. I just know that there's other things that I want to invest my time into. And I don't want to fully invest my every little second into this particular position. But if you are somebody who wants that fast, good money. I say, you know, give it give it a try. Waxing is an amazing career. And that's me, with me working for a company. But if you think about you working for yourself, if you can perfect your skill and get fast enough and you're able to do three different types of services in 15 minutes, you know what I mean? And you able, you're able to make all of that profit, all of that money on your own. You see what I'm saying? So whether you work for a company or you work for yourself, waxing is such a rewarding career. Um... But we've made it to the end of the video, you guys. I hope you enjoyed. Like I said, I'm sorry that it wasn't as... But if you guys want to see me working like on a busy Saturday, if I get enough comments, I will do I do have a video of me doing something similar like that. But if I get enough comments, likes, shares, and subscribes, if I get enough of those, I will do a video showing y'all a detailed video on showing y'all on how my books look on a busy saturday and how much money and how much potential you can make on a busy saturday because on saturdays i work way more hours and i'm always really really booked on saturdays so no matter the time of year i'm always booked on saturdays that's my busiest day so if i get enough comments like shares and subscribes we'll do a video regarding it if you guys are interested in my other wax and content i'm going to leave all my other videos in the description down below if you're not already subscribed thank you Please go ahead and subscribe to my channel. I would really appreciate it. Thank you so, so much if you made it this far. Don't forget to tune in to, into, to, into tomorrow's Vlogtober video. And until next time, see you guys later. Bye.